So today we're gonna learn about how to set up an ad with Google for YouTube video, okay? So the first step we're gonna do is we're gonna go to, uh, to, 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 to. First step we're gonna do, like I said, right now we're gonna learn about how to set up an ad with Google for YouTube video. If you, um, or if you have a website, if you have a blog and you wanna set up an, a campaign to blog and you wanna set up an, a campaign to get more traffic to your website or product online. The first step we're gonna do, we're gonna to go to Google AdWords and you're gonna see this right here. Um, so once you search for Google Ads, that's gonna give you the first option right here where it says AdWords, it's now Google Ads, get free Google all of that whatever click on it if you haven't it if you do not have an account yet i recommend you to go ahead and sign up it's so easy for you to sign up i'm not going to go through the whole steps on how to sign up for google adwords uh so if you do not have a google adwords i recommend you to go ahead and sign up for google adwords and if you already have one and you do not have to and you and you don't know how to set up a google ads for youtube video we're going to go ahead and click on Sign in and Google AdWords. My nephew is here with me right now. What's up? My hair, my hair is a mess. It's okay, guys. Okay, so once you're already in your Google AdWords account, you're gonna click where it says campaign. We're gonna click on campaign and you're gonna see this little plus sign. We're gonna click on add new campaign. And we're gonna select what what's your, what we're trying to target. We're, we're trying to get more leads. We're trying to get more sales. We're trying to get more website traffic. Um, so in this case, we're gonna focus on getting more leads, more emails. <laughs> Um, so we're gonna select leads and then we're gonna go for a campaign video. I'm telling you that right now we're gonna learn how to set up a YouTube campaign with Google AdWords. So that way you can get more traffic or more views to your videos or if you are promoting a product online or on YouTube, this is the best way for you to get more traffic to your website. YouTube videos or YouTube products that you are advertising on YouTube, okay? So we're gonna click on videos and then we're gonna continue right here at the bottom. Remember we we'll set it up for conversions. I'm going backwards again. All right, so we're gonna name our campaign. Don't get lost people, okay? So I'm at the first step right here. We're gonna name our campaign. Just put a simple name for your campaign. In this, in this case, I'm trying to, um, I have a video that I want to advertise. And in this particular video that I want to advertise, I am uh, promoting a system for uh, affiliate marketers, uh, people who's trying to get more traffic to their website, product or online store, e-commerce. Um, so I'm gonna name this Internet Traffic Mastery. That's the name of the product that I'm advertising that I'm setting out there, okay? So that's my, that's, this is just for uh, a name that you can recognize every time you open your Google AdWords and you see your campaigns because you might have different campaigns and you have to name, name them uh, with different names. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna just show you an example. Uh, I want to show you an example of what I'm talking about, what, 
why do you have to name your campaigns, okay? Okay, so whenever you go to campaigns, this is what I'm talking about right here. This right here are your campaign names. Like right here, I have two already. I have Amazon one and I have internet traffic for affiliates, but I'm not using those two campaigns. Make sure you have to make, make sure you have, you have already set up your, uh, your payment methods. Make sure you have a credit card on file so that way Google can run your ads, okay? Okay, so we're gonna go, we were on campaign name. We already named our campaign. It's gonna be Internet Traffic Mastery. Leading strategy. Uh, if you go for maximize conversion, uh, Google is gonna spend your money like crazy. So we're gonna go for target CPA, cost per action. Every time people click on your ad, it's uh, that's when Google's gonna charge you for it. Otherwise, if you do, if you go for maximize conversions, uh, I don't recommend you that one because if you are barely starting, if, if you are a beginner, I don't recommend you that one. I recommend you to do target target CPA cost per action. <laughs> and right here, we're gonna, uh, as you can see right here at the bottom on this blue little square, it says the minimum, the minimum and the maximum that you can pay for every, uh, each visitor that clicks on your ad and actually buys from you. Uh, so right here, I'm gonna pay Google, I'm gonna pay them $8. I'm just giving you an example, guys. I'm not actually setting, I'm, I am setting up a campaign, but I'm not gonna run it, okay? So that's my uh, CPA targeting. And then right here where it says budget and dates, make sure you set up a a budget, either either it's daily or or monthly, however you wanna set it up. Uh, also make sure if you are a beginner and uh, you don't know how to start all these, and if you, I mean, if you are barely starting all the, uh, everything with Google, I recommend you to start from day one and stop it like um, start the date and end date right here. So in this case, I'm gonna do daily and right here, I'm gonna put how much I wanna spend every day. Um, let's say I wanna spend, I wanna spend $100 per day. And if I click on edit, Today is the first, uh, October the 1st, 2020. And if I want this campaign to end um, the th uh, October the 30th, I can go ahead and click on the 30th. And so this campaign, it's not gonna, after it, after it hits this date, it's not gonna run anymore. It's gonna stop there. But if you do not set up a date where you want the campaign to stop, Google does not care to be honest. They're gonna keep on running your campaign and they're gonna skip, they're gonna keep on spending your money. Also, if you do not have to spend one hundred if you don't have money to spend like a hundred dollars a day, which it, it can be more, it depends on the level of business that you are in. It it, it can be less, it, it, it can be it, it can be more than a hundred dollars. Okay. So there's people that spend five thousand, fifty thousand, twenty thousand dollars. $500 per day. Uh, in this case, I'm doing $100. You can just, you can start with uh, $10, 15, 20. But the more do you spend, the more happy that Google gets and they start running your campaign faster, okay? So that was our budget and dates and networks. We're gonna check networks. We're gonna do for YouTube results. We're gonna leave it as it is. And then locations, make sure you always select select your locations. So in this particular ad where we are targeting uh, people who is looking for uh, more traffic to get to their website or products or YouTube videos. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Um, 
So make sure you uh, select your locations. If you do all countries, like I said it before, Google is not gonna care about spending your money. They just uh, make sure you select certain locations. In this case, I'm gonna do, uh, we're gonna click on advanced search and there's, uh, there's gonna be a little map that appears on your right hand side. And then we can just look for the uh, countries that we're gonna target. But if you, if you only targeting people in the United States or uh, I don't know which country you are, just please select the country where you want your people. Just just select the, the, the country where you're targeting people, okay? I don't want you to go crazy and select other countries where there is no people where people might wanna buy your product, but you're not gonna be able to deliver it, right? So make sure you select the right country, right state. Um, so in this case, I live in Dallas, Texas. If, I, if I'm just selling in Dallas, I can just go ahead and do Dallas, Texas. And see? Because if I have a product that, that it's only selling in Dallas, Texas, and I'm not able to deliver it outside of the state or outside of uh, United States, there's no point. Uh, that's like scamming people. We don't want to scam people. So make sure you select the right country or state, local state or country, okay? So we selected Canada, what else? I can select like the top five English speakers, which is New Zealand, um, I get another one, UK. Done. We can make sure you save those countries, okay? And then for language, make sure you you select the right language that you're targeting because you do not want to select Spanish or Japanese, Chinese if you are only selling something in English. Uh, so make sure you select people or countries that speak English the most, okay? So in this case, in this case, I'm only targeting English. I can probably target the Spanish too, but I'm just gonna do English for now. I can do my, I can, I can make my ad appear in networks that pe where people speak Spanish. Anyway, so we're gonna keep scrolling down. Inventory, we're gonna leave it as a standard, standard inventory. Sure, add some content that's appropriate for most brands. Some exclusions has expanded and also excluded, for example. Okay, we're gonna leave it as it is. And then right here, make sure you select, for example, uh, we're setting up a YouTube video ad. So make sure you select these two right here so that your ad appears on on other videos, okay? And then we're gonna go for site link extension. We're gonna click on it, we're gonna see what that is. We're gonna leave it as it is. We don't, uh, remember the more you do things inside your uh, Google accounts, the more Google is gonna charge you too, okay? So be careful, don't go crazy and start adding like a lot of things that you don't need when you're starting your online business. Okay, and then conversions. Uh, uh, make sure you check your devices. Show and show on all eligible devices: computer, mobile, tablets, and TV screens. We're gonna sell, we're gonna leave that one as it is. If you want just to target a specific uh, devices, you can select this one, and it's gonna give you the options whether it's tablets, computers, or phones only. 
frequency limit, how many times it comes in. Uh, we're gonna leave it as it is. Schedule, you can schedule your ad. So like if I'm setting up my ad right now, I can I can schedule my ad to start running later, like around 5 p.m., whatever. Anyways, that's up to you. Add group name, right here, right here where it says add group name, we're gonna add, if in this case, I'm targeting people that's looking for uh, internet traffic, people who's trying to get more traffic to the website product or um, YouTube videos or online store. So in this case, I'm gonna add a group where it's similar to the one that I'm advertising so that way I can get more views or traffic or sales conversions. Hmm. I'm gonna do choose this for so this particular group relates to what I'm adverti advertising, okay? And then we're gonna go to demographics. Uh, make sure you select uh, Right here, we're gonna leave it. We're gonna leave it as it is by default. We're not gonna unselect anything. We're just gonna do unknown. We're gonna uncheck unknown. Uh, right here, you can uh, here's the edges of people that you wanna target. Make sure you select the ones that you're trying to target because there might be some people that are, that are super old or there's kids that might not watch your video or your ad that might not that might not be interesting in your ad, okay? So you can select or unselect those options right here. But for now, I'm just gonna leave it as it is. Let's go down, audiences. Uh, right here, you can search, you can choose one of this right here that it's similar to the things that you are selling or advertising. Um, so in this, in this case, I'm advertising something related to business. I'm gonna click there. And then for keywords, you can use this right here on your right hand uh, side for keywords like, uh, so I'm gonna give you I'm gonna give you a, a little secret, which is not a secret. You can go to, for keywords, you can go to Google or you can go to YouTube and search for, in this case, like I, like I told you guys, I'm selling something related with traffic, online business, e-commerce, affiliate marketing, uh, e-commerce. So we are going to search for, uh, create traffic and you see this um, you see all these keywords you, you you're gonna see you're gonna scroll down all the way to the bottom and uh, and if you want you can select these keywords and just copy. Make sure the keywords are related to the product that you are selling. Otherwise, Google is just gonna spend your money like crazy and not give you results. And if you are getting overwhelming about how to set up this ad, I recommend you to go back over and over again as many times as you want and watch this video until you get this uh, campaigns right, okay? Uh, it takes time for some of you already have some knowledge about how to set up an ad. Some of you, I mean, if you're watching this video, it's because you don't know how to set up an, a YouTube ad, uh, which is this. Uh, a YouTube ad is going to look like this. Look, that's whenever you go to, whenever you watch a video, and then an ad appears. You see, when you're watching a video, and then for some reason it stops and 
and the video that you were watching stops and there's an ad that pops that pops out so that's that's what we're doing right now we're setting up that ad right now okay you can add as many words as you want in this case i'm just gonna do this i'm just giving you a little example and then we're gonna scroll down so i gave you a little trick right here where you can go for or for keywords and if you look at the right side right here oh this one doesn't have any oh here's some more keywords right here that, that we can just copy and paste yes uh, all right so i gave you a little trick for how to look for keywords for free without you having to pay or you can go to google look i'm going to give you another, another example where you can find free keywords remember we were looking for affiliate marketing keywords so this right here when you go to google searches uh and you you type in the word that you're looking for and then you click on it and then if you go here on report again, you can just copy and paste again all these keywords like this that are related to the product that you are selling online. Okay, so we're gonna keep on scrolling down. Topics, well, you can select any of these topics. These are like groups. We're going to select online communities, something related to our product. And then we're going to go to placements. Placements. We're going to go for YouTube videos. Uh, so my I want my ad to appear to appear on YouTube videos. So every time you are watching a video and uh, there's a, an ad popping out, that might be my ad. Who knows? Okay, so then right here, it's going to ask us for our YouTube URL. Okay, so we're going to go to our channel. Can I go to my channel? I'm going to go to my channel. And we're gonna select the video that we want to be that we want to advertise on YouTube. I mean for Google. So we're gonna go to videos and then we're gonna go to we're going to select the video that we want to advertise. We're gonna get the link. We're gonna we're gonna copy and paste that link, that URL, paste it. And there's our video. As you can see right here on my right side, or your right side, whatever, the ads getting created right here. Okay. So we're going to scroll down again. We are going to put the URL where we want Google to redirect people to our website or our product. So I'm going to do for things.com. And then right here you can check your uh, this is how it looks on youtube and this is how it looks on uh, google video partners okay so and then right here we're gonna uh name uh we have a call to action we're gonna do take action now i'm gonna type in take action now and instead of like i don't want my name to appear there we're gonna do affiliate traffic
Ooh. And there is our campaign, guys. We have already created our campaign. And this is how it's going to look uh, on the videos for YouTube, okay? So uh, this is our ad. Remember, uh, once you have already hit where it says create your video ad, you're gonna go to your channel and select the video that you want to advertise. So in this case, like I was, I, like I told you guys, I was, make sure your keywords are related to the video that you are advertising, to the product that you are advertising. If the keywords that you put on Google are not related to your uh, video, are not related to your product, it's gonna be so hard for people to find your product and um, and you are gonna think that Google is stealing your money, which which is not, it's actually, you need the strategies, you need the, the right targeting, the right strategies, the right traffic and the, the right uh, keywords for people to find your product, okay? Otherwise, you are just gonna lose your money. So that's why I recommend you to watch this video as many times as you want to get everything set up right in the right way. Um, and like I said, you can start with as low as fifteen dollars, twenty dollars, just to, just to test your videos, your video ads. I think we have everything set up right here for our ad, so we're gonna go ahead and click on. So this is how our ad is gonna look on YouTube videos. Mm. So my, my intention here is to give you a step-by-step -step on how to set it up and how to get a set it up right, okay? I'm not trying to sell you anything here. I'm just trying to help you because I was there too. I was trying to look for help and there was nobody that would help me, but I'm giving you step-by-step -step how to set up your YouTube ad on Google AdWords for your product online or website or if you are blogging. Okay, so this is it, guys. We have we have already created our first campaign for YouTube ads with Google AdWords. So we're gonna click on Create Campaign. the call to action was too long. Okay. All right, this is it guys. Uh, good luck and I hope you set up your, your ad correctly. Um, oh. Okay, in this case, we're gonna go to here, we're gonna copy this, and we're gonna put this in here. The display URL, it's where, it's the website name where people go to Google, like this here. Let me show you real quick. The display URL is gonna, it's gonna look like this right here. Affiliate program, amazon.com. That's where, that when people clicks on, on this, 
they get redirected to a um, to the website where they're uh, where they're able able to buy the product that you are advertising. So and that's that is it, guys. We have already created our first YouTube ad with Google AdWords. And that is and that is our campaign. Remember, this is our this is how we named our campaign. Uh, on my next video, guys, I'm gonna show you how to link your YouTube video so you can uh, start any money. You can mon how to monetize your YouTube video so you can start any money with YouTube. And I'm gonna show you how to link your YouTube channel with Google AdWords. Okay, so I'll see you guys in my next video. Um, go ahead and subscribe because I'm gonna be uh, sharing more videos about how to set up websites, how to set up blogs, how to blog, how to advertise your blog or website product that you are selling online, how to set up ads with Google, and uh, how to link your YouTube channel to Google AdWords so that way you get paid from YouTube. And there's also more videos about how to set up your first YouTube video, how to get the right keywords, how to create the thumbnail. I'm gonna also share with you guys how to, the, the apps that I use for to edit my videos for free. I don't pay anything. Every time I, I edit my YouTube videos, I don't pay for nothing. Don't worry about to have a high quality camera. It's about the content that you're giving out there, okay? So I'll see you guys in my next video and I hope you get some knowledge out of this video. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you on my next video. Thank you, bye-bye.